Well, it's been a while since I did an update on this truck, but <clears throat> what I'm doing is, uh, now before we get into this, you know, I'm not a pro uh, body guy or paint or anything. I just do it because uh, it's pretty expensive to get done, and this is just temporary because the whole truck's getting painted soon anyways. Um, so it's just kind of for the, the winter. Yeah, you can see like all the paint lines and stuff. We'll just ignore that because I suck at painting. But yeah, there's uh, I took all the that vinyl siding off and I actually like it. It's a lot cleaner of a look and more modern, I guess. You know, from afar, it, oh, it's not bad. And uh, what, why it looks so uh, dimpled like that is, uh, well, part of the reason because I suck at painting, but also because it's that that rocker guard, that undergo under uh, coat, and uh, it's paintable. So I just uh, primed and painted over top of that, and yeah, and get a new fender for that soon. Uh, I'm going to get the smoothie front bumper, and uh, I'm going to get a, a rear roll pan for it. Um, cowl hood soon and uh, of course I'm going to get a billet grill I am I'm still undecided whether I want the the Chevy one and then uh, just these parts here would be chrome the chrome billet and then uh, the the Chevy part there would be painted white to match the truck and then this the Chevy would be black painted black or uh, do a, a GMC one, build a grill without the GMC in the middle and then have it painted white too. Uh, this side's not done yet. You can still see the black uh, rocker guard there and touch up spots. That vinyl, when I took it off, it was uh, took a bunch of paint with it and left some double sided tape everywhere. Yeah, it was. And if, if you're going to do it, I recommend a heat gun and to really let that heat get at it because that it'll peel off that double-sided tape a lot easier. And yeah, I'm, I'm probably just going to get a whole new driver's door because this one's kind of done with that and then all the paint chips that came off and then underneath it's kind of rotted and uh, missing the lock thing it fell inside there. <laughs> yeah, that's her. Um, I might be uh, doing a, uh, just throwing a new muffler soon, like uh, just a shorter Magnaflow. I have a, I have a pretty big one in there right now, so I might just do a shorter one. Here's a little side view here. So if you, uh, I know I'm kind of boring in my videos, but you know, please like and subscribe and. Uh, check out my Facebook page. There'll be photos and updates and stuff like that. And you can uh, answer questions on there and everything. So, yeah, thanks for watching.